In this lecture, we are going to learn about a very important concept in Python, exception handling. What is an exception? An exception is an unexpected error that occurs during the execution of a program. When an error happens, Python stops the program right there and throws an exception. If we don't handle this exception, our program crashes. So exceptions are Python's way of saying, hey, something went wrong and I don't know how to continue. An exception is a runtime error that interrupts normal flow. Python provides a try accept mechanism to handle those errors gracefully. We use this to keep our programs running, even when something goes wrong. Let's see the real life analogy. Let's say you are withdrawing money from an ATM. You insert your card, type your PIN and request 10,000 rupees. But your balance is only 500. Now, instead of giving you cash, the machine shows a message, insufficient balance. It handles the error gracefully, instead of breaking down or giving wrong results. That's exactly what exception handling is. We detect the problem and respond to it in a controlled way. Let's now go over a few everyday situations where exceptions might occur in Python. Imagine this. You try to divide a number by zero. Python throws a zero division error. You try to open a file that doesn't exist. Python throws a file. Not found error. You try to convert a string like hello into an integer. Python throws a value error. In each of these cases, Python doesn't just continue. It raises an exception and stops the program unless we handle it. Why do we need exception handling? because when errors happen, we want to period. Prevent the program from crashing. Show a useful message to the user. Maybe log the issue for debugging and continue the program if possible. Without exception handling, even one small bug can stop the whole application. And that's a terrible experience for users. How does Python handle exceptions? Well, Python gives us a simple and powerful way to handle exceptions using the try accept block. The logic goes like this. We write the code that might cause an error inside the try block and then we handle the error in the accept block. If the code in the try block runs successfully, Python skips the accept block. But if there's an error, it jumps to the accept block and runs that code. After that, Python may run an else block or a finally block if they exist and then continues the program.